Agriculture is one of the critical sectors in Ghana's economic growth and development. According to the World Bank report in 2019, 29.75% of the country's workforce was employed by this sector. Bandai is a district in the northern part of Ghana with 89% of population engaged in rain-fed agricultural activities. The district is popularly known for the cultivation of yams, aside others, crops like maize, cassava and granite. For the district to grow and develop, the agricultural activities has to contribute much to reduce poverty, increase food security and provide sustainable jobs for the workforce. In recent times, there is insufficient rainfall within the district and this has affected the agricultural activities of households and persons with disabilities. What are the experts' opinions about this climate change? When we talk about climate change, climate change is an uh, average weather condition of a particular place for a long period of time. What causes drought in the Banda district is cutting down of trees. Banda is well known for its production in yam, and yam production demands a vast land. Bush burning, cutting down of trees to use our yam supporting sticks are all those things that affect the climate. Let's hear how a farmer is impacted by this climate change. Normally when we experience drought like this, uh, production from a farm is always low. That is failure to proper germination so that the production becomes very low. And uh, if I don't get maybe the production that I want, if, if I don't get the right the production that I want, that can satisfy me and my family, and it goes lower, it uh, actually going to affect our living. It is the uh, yam I do sell to take care of my children education. And so when the production is low, I can't get the income that I need to take care of the children and then the family. What are residents who have lived in the district for long have to say about the rainfall within the district? Right now, when it wants to rain for us, it rain once in April and when we plant our crops, it will stop again in May. By then, our crops which have germinated will dry up again. How will you survive this as a farmer in this situation? <laughs> This is retrogressing us as farmers. We don't get the rains as it were for us in those days. <laughs>